Hello, traders. Uh, this is Dominic again. I'm here with a famous Supremo. He's in the Discord group, but his real name is Christian. And uh, anong full name mo, Christian Mana Manansalas? Yeah, Christian Manansala. Yes. And he's originally from the Philippines and uh, here in Manila. Deva, you're from Manila. Yeah, I grew up in uh, Paco, Manila. Then uh, eventually we moved to Makati. And then uh, you're now stay, uh, you're now um, living in the states, right? That's correct. So right now I'm, I'm re re residing here in Columbus, Ohio. Uh, Galing. Um, pero dati you know you, uh, I think when I spoke to you before we were talking about you you're a product of Accenture, dito sa Pilipinas sa call center, di ba? That's correct. Ah uh, yeah. So in the when I was working at Accenture, uh, I'm not uh, I was I wasn't in the call center business. Um, a consulting, we were still consulting. More, more on IT consulting okay. and uh, production support sa uh, different clients nila dito sa US. Okay. And, yeah, and then you, I had the opportunity na they sent me here in the US for a couple of months. Right. And to experience you know, working with the US Galing. counterparts. Yeah. So now you you now you um you now US US citizen there and when did you move to the US? Uh, we moved here around 2006. Uh, 2006, okay. Yeah. Um, a lot. Of, I know there's a lot of followers out here. I'm gonna show a, a screen if I can find a screen here. You know, um, again, I follow Christian here because he's been uh, doing really well in futures, and he's one of the few Filipinos I know that are is successful in futures, and that's what I want to introduce to here in the Philippines. Most of the mga Pinoy dito. Kasi alam ko uh, mga traders dito puro trading sa forex pero you know they don't realize uh, how it, some people yeah it can be profitable but it's more swing trading to be profitable in forex and I think to re really day trade if you consider what day trading is you get, get in, in and out of, you, out of the position within the day I don't see a lot of people who are successful in day trading much less in forex or even um, or even in stocks Philippine stocks but I think the best uh, opportunity for you to really uh, have a sideline job, puede. it's like mm -hmm. oh, trading in futures. And I know Christian here has been very successful. I've been following him. In fact, there is a group uh, that he's on a Discord group. Uh, in fact, let me do share share screen here. So I can show you his group um, right here. And this is a group, it's called Hype Beast Futures. And, uh, you know, manually he has a system, it's a scalping system. It's called uh, King Shark. Is it, wait, King Shark, ba? Yep, that's my third uh, right. manual scalping oh, strategy. Th yeah, so if you go up to here, you can join his um, Discord. He has here the tutorials right here. He has the King, Sh King Shark. Um, Basically, this is the scalping strategy. Strategy. He also has what we call what was the other one you have? Uh, uh, flash flash point. point. Right. Yep. And then the first one is the flash. Okay. So those are his three strategies. And I think the most popular one right now, and I've been trading it. I did it manually, and now he has a. He's about. He, he's basically beta test testing a robot, which is really actually pretty cool. And this is basically a system. You can go there. And it's all free, so there's really yeah. no the walang bayad dito, libre dito. You just have to learn how to do it. He does answer some questions, and he's always bombarded with questions. So how do you trade the system? He even gives you the the free indicator that he uses, which is the Unu Rank Uni Renko, and it's a free download. And he also gives you the settings and basically the instruction how to run it or how to trade it. And now he's mm -hmm. come up with a bot how to trade it um, automatically. And the thing is, I have been testing it. Uh, here is my results. And this is what basically my results are all on here. And I just, I've been testing it for what basically a, I believe, and here I have it, uh, I have the, there we are, the spreadsheet. I just basically been testing it for the past, what, since the 12th, right? And it's been profitable mm -hmm. right now at net. I'm taking commissions off. It's been profitable $143.20. And that's basically only based in 
it's the one, two, three days. Oh, no, 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 wait, wait. One, the 10th until the 14th. So basically four days. Because the thing is, I was testing it on RTY. That's what I was originally testing on. And it was, make, it was very profitable at first, and then it just tanked on RTY. I think the RTY market is more, um, it's not as, as uh, consistent, should I say, as ES. Yeah. S, ES has a, has a distinct pattern where it trades. That's why I like trading it. There is always a pattern and it stays by that pattern. That's why I like ES better. In fact, you see, I do have losses, but it's limited. It's basically at 187.50, which is basically 15 ticks, if you compute that. Mm. That's very manageable. So his robot with that, when I, uh, there's, there's, um, in fact, on his um, Discord group, he basically shows you the, um, the default settings, right? So where is this? Uh, right here. And the sa. Ah, uh, bot dito. And the sa kabilang Discord group. Ay, tama. No, that was my, that was mine. Okay, done. So this is basically right here is chat. His alerts is right here. So this is basically his um, default settings for each of the instruments that he trades, which is uh, NASDAQ, and he has ES as well as Russell, and also does Dow. And those are the instruments he trades with this bot. And the results he's been getting right now is basically this one where I showed, yeah, this is the most recent one. And he says ES is killing it. Um, while the other ones are really killing him, <laughs> and this was just <laughs> this was just on Friday, right? Yeah. So basically, yeah, so there are some days where you cannot control it. <laughs> right, Tama. That's why I said, you know, for if someone is going to come here and trade, well, I'm experienced. I just use the robot. Mas magaling pang ES kasi it's very consistent. Yeah. Ilang true. contracts? Ano ano? Ilang contracts ba nito trade madito? Dalawa? Two? Um, no, four. Wow. I don't draw down with John. I don't know largest draw down with John. Um uh, usually yung ES live pinapanood ko kapag uh, nag nagni-run ko yung Autobot. No. Um probably pinaka max will be like around 500. Yeah, good. So once it reaches that uh, turns off the bot bot. Um or you no, manually uh, turn it off. No, I, yeah, no, I I watch it, but right. my stop loss is like 16 ticks. Okay. So um, more or so, less mga 800 no but it doesn't hit that maybe around two two points it goes back already so oh, okay okay yeah good yeah so that's actually pretty because i've been watching your results as well that's very consistent at 800 so no wonder you're trading four contracts which i wouldn't advise uh say if you're if you're doing a funded account uh the combine it's usually two contracts the maximum now before depending because yeah, uh, um, or to the trade, they have a scaling thing where Lilo doesn't, and now yeah. into uh, U Profit, well, that's the scaling plan. Then that's why I'm going then. So oh. I might I might try that as well. In fact, uh, here are my results with the with the uh, with the bot uh, right here. Oh, here are my settings. That's why I always said my I, this is how I'm going to trade it. I narrowed my instruments to the ES. ES offers a slow methodical market that provides a bot small consistent profits with a manageable drawdown with is basically 15 ticks. Best time to use the bot, what I found out so far is between 9 a.m. to 11.30 a.m. Mm -hmm. And then I would start off if they're trading. Now I haven't tried this on a on a micro account. You see, I mean, some of them they want to trade their own money. It's on $500. But they want to trade on one contract. I know micro di ba? Oh. but i have not tried it on micro but i think i'm gonna try doing it on micro one time and see how it does you say if you can make 50 50 dollars a day on a micro galing na yun. <laughs> but ma ma ang mahirap lang po sa micro you need to target a higher You're right big profit oh because they must volatile yeah. sila di ba? <laughs> yeah uh, but then you have i mean to also... if, if it hits the profit then it should yeah. be good as long as you calculate the commissions right and also, you you might have to widen your uh, stop loss as well. Yeah. yeah. Right. So that's why I'm gonna try testing the, testing on a micro one time. But at, at the same time, right now, if people who want to get funded, they can actually just put on the bot and actually earn between 100 to 200 dollars a day. But then I own. Yep. Yep. Right? If 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 your combine is for a whole month, yeah. um, 
and calculate it, it might it might increase your target profit within a month. Right. Um, if not, then you can just continue the next month as long as you don't you know, lose right. the account. Right, exactly. And so this is again, his, his, um, his uh, Discord group is called Hype Beast Futures. And he, he's always, always bombarded with a lot of questions. Uh, but again, that's all free. So before I even ask you these other questions, let me get this out. Uh, stop. Okay. So it's some question about data then. So when did you, when did you start? What? Okay. When you started trading, when did you start trading? Talaga, yung the double mo, you started dabbling sa trading talaga. Or how did you get started? Uh, so how did I get started? Maybe like uh, around 2000. 18. Ah, okay. So, so 2018, I was working on a project sa Oakland, California, and mm. I've been traveling there like weekly mm. for the past for like two years already. Mm. And then, malapit na matapos yung project, maybe a couple more months more. Um, I t- you know, I tried to find other opportunities. And then I was o- I was always thinking. Maybe I can do something on my own, like do a part-time, mm. uh, do passive income. Right. And I, I tried network marketing, <laughs> <laughs> but I was unsuccessful because mm. hindi ako magaling mag Oh, ako din. And hindi, hindi rin ako maka-invite uh, yeah. <laughs> sa sali sa network marketing. Oh. So, uh, that was a no. <laughs> and, then, and then I bumped into like uh, an ad with Timothy Sykes. Ah, so, yeah. About, about yung, ano, yung, ano, yung uh, pump and dump, yung mga penny stocks ba yun? Yes, yes. Okay, so, okay. yung mga penny stocks and yeah. then yung mga, mga sinasabi niya, mga strategy niya na naging millionaire siya from nothing. Yeah. So, after that, nag-read the search pa ako, nag-YouTube ako, pinag-aralan ko siya. Hmm. So, possible ito, sabi ko ganyan. So, Maybe I can use my own money to start up penny stocks lang naman penny, di ba? Uh-huh. So um, I even attended his one of his workshops live. Um, oh, kung tama wow. Florida for <laughs> a, a whole week uh, and attended. Uh-huh. <laughs> but it turns out, kani na basa ko sa libro na libro niya yung binili ko yung uh-huh. penny stocking 101 or something. Yeah. Hindi niya sinabi sa workshop. <laughs> So more on ano sila yung para bang uh, pakita lang nila yung ano nila yung na, nakamit nila. Oh. So para lang magkaroon ka lang hope. Oh, ayan yeah, tama. Yeah, kaya kung pag umattend ka sa workshop, parang uuwi kang oh, pa, by next year ganito na rin ako. <laughs> <laughs> tama. <laughs> so eh biglang nar- sinubukan ko yung penny stock. Oh. Um, but hindi ako naging successful. Uh, Mahirap yun then, kasi kasi puro pump and dump yung mga yung stocks yun, di ba? Yeah, so pump and dump eh. So, kailangan nag- nanonood ka ng news, yeah, nagbabasa ka lagi, and yeah, everything. Yeah. Wala akong time. Wala akong time kasi may trabaho pa rin naman ako. <laughs> so, Tama. hindi ko rin magawa yung ginagawa nila. Eh, halos lahat yung mga nakita kong students niya na naging successful, mga tambay lang sa bahay. <laughs> hindi, na, hindi naman katrabaho eh, di ba? Nakikitira. Yung iba, nat- nat- nakikitira sa magulang pa nila, oh, sa tawa. basement ng magulang nila. Ganun yung mga kwenta nila eh. So, eh ako may pamilya na ako, mahirap oh. sabi ko. Hindi, hindi, hindi posible sa akin ito. So, nag-research pa ako ng ano pa bang pwede kong gawin. And, what, um, na, na, na-encounter ko yung options. Options hmm. trading naman. Uy, sabi stock, ko, options. Stock, stock, stock options, di ba? Yeah, stock options. Stock options yeah. 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 So, sabi ko mas madali ito mm. yung stock options. Tapos, mas malaki yung return yeah. sa, sa totoo lang. And hindi mo kailangan ng malaking capital. So, nagsimula ako Robin Hood lang, ganyan. Oh. And then, TD Ameritrade. So far naman, naging break-even lang ako doon. Oh. Uh, hindi rin ako tumagal. Dahil parang, nanalo ka nga ng isang, misan, isang trade lang. Oh. Nanalo ka ng 2,000, yeah. 4,000. Yeah. And then, meron ako isang trade na, Uy, sabi ko, naku, mananalo ako dito. Oh. So, asok pa ako. Oh. Hanggang sa 4,000 na naitaya ko, eh, di ba, eventually mag-expire yun. Tsaka, oh, yeah, tama, ako, tama. Yeah, ako, yeah. options, biglang bumabaksa. Oh, oh. So, nawala yung profit ko. <laughs> so, sabi ko, sabi ko, naku, sabi ko, hindi ko pwede gawin yung options. Tapos, and, wala akong enough capital. So, mm. I cannot, like, if I enter in a trade, 
And pangatlong trade ko na yun. Oh. Hindi ko ma-exit ka agad. Hindi Tama. ko... You know, so, ma- ma- malalaki yung account ko. Um, and dahil hindi ko ma-exit, na-loss ko yung pera ko. Di ba? Wow. So, parang sabi ko, hindi, hindi fit sa akin options trading. <laughs> Tala, may, may capital ako. Oh. And, 25,000 yata or something. Tama. So, de, yeah, um, tama. That's yun yung kailangan mo talaga sa, ano, yeah, sa, or, op- sa options talaga. Kasi may PDT rule. Yeah, Kasi tama. PDT rule. So, and then sa sabi ko, magaling lang ako siguro, in and out lang ako, in and out. Tama. Sabi ko nga. Eh, pero ka, parang lugi ako kung three times lang ako makagawa ng trade sa isang oh. linggo. Oh. Tapos, maraming mangyayari sa buong linggo eh, mamimiss mo yung opportunity, di ba? Tama. Ngayon, kung may cash account ka naman, pwede rin, pero wala mabagal kasi magsisimula ka sa 500, 1,000. Yeah, tama, so, tama. Mahina tama, pa rin eh. Mahina. So, uh, eventually, tapos na, 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 na nagbabrowse-browse lang ako, tapos na, na, nakita ko yung top step ad. Mm. Uh, so, about futures trading. Sa right. pagkakot futures trading. <laughs> tapos sabi, tapos nag-research pa ako, tapos na, 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 nalaman ko, Walang PDT rule yung right, futures wala. trading, yeah. sabi ko. Yeah, yeah. Uy, posible sa akin ito ha. <laughs> Research pa ako. Tapos hanggas na nak- nak- natuklas, natuklas lang ko yung ES. Mm. About ES and how, yeah. how they trade it. Right. Uh, so, in-apply ko yung mga knowledge na nakuha ko sa penny stocking, sa options. Yun yung mga uh, deep buying, mga yeah. head and shoulders. Halos right. lahat yun. Pinag-ara- yung mga pinag-arap ko, in-apply ko. So, sa... So, una kong uh, combine, sa top step ako nagsimula talaga. Uh-huh. So, na, hindi na, na, na fan ka ba doon sa top step? Oo, oh, na-fun din ako eventually. <laughs> anong anong uh, account? Anong account? 150K. Wow, 150K. galing. You still, you, so, still have that, you still have that account? Wala na? Ah, wala na. Okay. After noon, na-withdraw ko rin eh. Okay. Tapos, nagsubok naman ako sa iba ulit. Um, Kamusta yung, payout, uh, yung withdrawals sila, nila? Yung uh, top step? Okay ba yan? I I I've, I've heard some complaints medyo matagal sila. Ah uh, nung time na yon medyo ano pa eh uh, siguro mga 2019 yata yun eh. Um uh, mabis pa sila noon mga magkita ka lang ng mga 2 weeks to 1 month. Eh. Yeah. Yeah. So you're able Pero, to withdraw and you're able and, to withdraw and, your profits, di ba? Yeah, yeah. Galing. Sa totoo naman siya talaga yung company niya. Tsaka din uh-huh. search ko din, sabi ko, "Oy, okay to." Um sa US based. Yeah. Actually, before before pala mag-top step, uh, may natok na sa pako isang nagpa-fund din. Uh, ano pangalan TradeNet. So, sa Europe, sa Europe, ah, TradeNet. Futures din sila. Mag, Ay, uh, hindi. Mag- More, ang contrast nila is CFDs. Tinatawag nila CFDs. Ah, yes. Yeah, yeah. Mahirap ang CFDs. Alam mo yun? Uh, so, for, para silang, para silang stocks. Yeah. It moves like stocks and you trade it like stocks. Right. Pero, hindi siya stock. Right. So, and, and eventually pinagbawal na siya sa US yeah. hindi ka rin kaya yung kasi, ma- kasi manipulate kasi, kasi mani- manipulate din ng ano yung price nila kasi it's run by yeah. the price is derived by the broker's price hindi yung ano yung ano may ibang price oh, yeah. sa, sa sa market than sa broker's price nila yeah and kinaganda rin doon uh, they, pwede mong ano uh, there's no PDT rule yeah uh, tama so talagang sabi ko uy okay din to so sinubukan ko siya doon Tapos eventually kasi tinanggal nila lahat ng US accounts. So, mm. nabitawan ko rin kasi ba, ba, hindi pala pwede oh. sa akin oh, oh, <laughs> sa US. Oh. Tapos, is, is, sinabi ko pa nga sa brother ko na nakatira sa Australia or baka pwede sila yung mag-open account para sa akin. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Like eh, siyempre, maapektuhan din sila kasi income yung sa kanila eh marami sila benefits. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oo, oh, about yeah, yeah. sa tax. Yeah, yeah. So, may benefits meron, sila kasi sa Australia eh. <laughs> yeah, kasi merong ganun, IG. Narinig yeah. mo IG? Yung broker IG? I, IG? No, yeah. not really. Meron din sila IG Australia kasi ah, I was, I, I had okay. in, I used to trade with IG dito sa US and then what happened, like you said, na ban sila dyan. So, I was oh. able to join sa IG sa ano. That's what they do. It's all, it's more CFDs. That's I traded oh, with I them. And I was trading. Actually, I had a big um, ten thousand more than between ten and fifteen thousand dollars. I hold on. And one trade, one trade, I made over eight thousand dollars. See if these two, okay? Mm-hmm. So what happens? They saw my account. I made that in one day. So parang now they red flagged me, and so I started another. Kasi may system na ako ako trade yon. 
So I had another one where it was basically making money again. And I go, ano nangyari dito? Bakit natalo ako? And I'm just saying, are they are they manipulating my thing? So I found out they were they that trade was up as much as another five thousand dollars. Bigla natalo ako hanggang na mukang na naubos yung account ko. Oh. Say I can't go. I can't get out of the trade. Oh my goodness. So I said, wait, are they manipulating this? Yeah, it's possible. So I said, how come I can't exit the trade? So after that, wala. I said I can't really do this because I talo ko don. So okay, continue, continue your journey. Yeah. So after that trade net, then like I said, top step. Mm-hmm. Uh, so when I started top step, so I applied the same uh, strategies that I've been using, like yeah. fibs, uh, mga patterns. Uh, actually, hindi pa ako nagpa-price action trading because mm-hmm. um, di pa ako nag-scalp. So yeah. I was like holding. Um, so you're more of a swing trader. Were you more of a swing trader back then, or no? Yeah. Yes, swing, yes, swing more trader. on swing trader. Okay. Um, and then eventually, hindi, hindi ko rin naipasa yung ano yung step one ng top step. Oh. So I did, I did more research. Um, and then natuklas ako about scalping. Mm. Ano yung scalping? Yung parang first first time ko lang na marinig yung word na scalping yeah. sa actually. And then, oh sabi ko galing nito ah, may possibility na I can make that profit mm. in one trade. Yeah. And then I just do it like maybe six to ten times. Yeah. And then I'm done for the day. Sabi Tama, ko ganun. Oh, yeah. So, and then yung sa step one kasi ng top step, walang scaling. So, yeah. I can trade up to 15 contracts. Um, so, I, I have, that's, that's when I discovered the, and created the flash strategy. Um, I was targeting four ticks, right. sometimes three, two. Right. Um, And then not sa, para sa isang trade lang 500 agad or so Tama. in less than 5 days na ko na yung profit target Tama. na 9k. So tungtong ako eh kasi na, napasa ko. <laughs> And then I started posting it ah uh, actually more on sa akin na uh, sharing lang eh. Hmm. Uh, and then nung when I started stop step, sabi ko wala rin akong masundan na tao, sabi hmm. ko wala akong masundan. Sana ako mag-aaral, sabi ko ganyan. So, nagtanong lang ako sa group doon, sabi ko, meron ba kayo dito ng ano, group na nag-future trading? Mm. You share, share ideas and everything, gano'n. Walang walang sumagot. May sumagot sa person, sabi niya, you need to be funded para makapasok sa group na yun. Sabi ko, ah, gano'n? Eh, parang, <laughs> parang sense yun, sabi ko. <laughs> so, sabi ko, sige, magsisimula ako. Sino sum, sumali? Ang dami ng comments. So, oh. Sige, kaya nasimula ko yung group na no, high beast. Hindi, hindi pa high beast yun dati. Oh. So, Uh, after that, may mga na-meet ako ng mga futures trader na magaling din mag-swing trading. Mm. At saka mag-scalping. So, uh-huh. na- bibigay sila na advice. Uh, yung mga advice nila, uh, sinundan ko rin kahit paano. Mababait kasi may mga mababait talaga rin uh-huh. uh, na encounter mo. Uh, tapos, uh, yung iba pa nga, nagsuggest CL, yung yeah. trade nila. Uh-huh. Ako sinubukan ko rin yung CL, pero... Medyo uh, ano, erratic ang movement nila. Erratic nga eh. Uh, At saka siguro, during their, their time, uh, sa London Sesyo, sila nagtitrade. Uh, hindi, hindi ko na mag- matrade yun. Tulog uh, na ako. <laughs> so, no, tama, na, tama. Hindi, ayaw ko na magtulugan. Pag uh, ayaw ko magtrade, tapos iiwan ko. Oo, diba? uh, tama. Yeah. So, yeah, tama. Sige, doon ako natatalo minsan eh. So, so after that, yun nga, na, and then I do the scalping strategy. And then I pass. Then sa I started ES, post. Sa e, most, mostly sa on ES. ES. Okay. Yeah, actually, Island talaga. Mm. And then, siguro, timing lang din yun. Um, I, I, I noticed this in the market wherein pag bago yung contract, ES mm. maganda ang yeah. kilos. Tama. Pero pag patapos na yung, yeah. yung malapit na ma-expire, yung ES hindi na maganda ang kilos. Kasi alam ba, Kaya, you, 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 ako sa yeah, you know, you have to look at the CME. Kasi remember that week of the expiration, medyo mm-hmm. mahina. You have to look which one, the, you have to compare the volume Mm-hmm. Of yeah. which has the most volume. If you see during that last week of expiration, you go to the CME website. You go to the um, let me see if I have it here. You go trade the contract that has the most um, volume. There's where you're gonna find the volatility. Because I'm still trading the old contract. Say in there. Look at the new contract. I'm gonna must must higit pa yung volumes that then sa 
that's uh, right. old contacts and new contact that's where they're all trading so that's why the last week always look at the CME so let me see if I can show the let me see if I can find it here hold on I'll just get it right now that's why the last week I have it here in the Here we are. So let me share this. Here, it shows you the quote. So here's the contracts, right? Mm -hmm. So let's say the last week of the June and September. In fact, we're still in May. Okay, this expires in June third week. You'll always look at the volume, right? So that yeah. last week, look where the volume is you'll eventually see that most likely it's going to be all trading the next next contract that's why the one on volume more <laughs> yeah <Okay. laughs> so yeah that's yeah so i said i go then when it's on one until i found that out uh i said wow no wonder it's trading no wonder we're long volatility okay go ahead continue so uh so eventually i passed in step one uh and then i started posting my results uh sa different groups then mm. oh, sa Facebook sa di, di, different Discord groups and then some some of them nagulat din sila kasi sila mga profits nila siguro mga uh, less than not 1k or something right. and then nakita nila 6k na nagawa ko sa isang yeah. araw yeah. Okay, I mean, ko pas possible naman eh mm. ngayon tas siguro may isa lang talaga may isang nagtanong sa akin na direct message ako and then I I I told him ko ano no tas sabi ko gumawa ako video eh ni siya ko lang to for please ganyan ganyan yeah. so, sabi ko na nandito ako sa may sarili akong group mm. gusto niyo sumali ganyan siguro yung taong yun may influensya nagulat na lang kaya nabukasan siguro mga uh, sekwenta na sumali sa group ko oh. and then lahat sila nag, nag direct message sa akin mm. uh, pwede magkaroon ng, ng invite ganyan oh. they want to learn kung ano yung ginawa kong strategy oh. yung flash strategy tapos lahat yun Sabi ko sige basta sabi ko practicein niyo lang muna. Mm. You you test it for yourself kung comfortable kayo and then trade it your way. Right. Kasi gusto niyo enhance uh, kayo bahala. Oh. Pero yeah, simple lang naman yung logic. And then eventually siguro ako couple of days lot may feedback mag na na dahil sa akin na na fan ka. Nila na fan sila. Na, Oh, na pumasa sila, oh. na nagiging profitable sila, nagiging green sila sa isang araw. Oh. Eh, parang mat masaya ang pakinggan. Yeah, na, yeah, yeah, tama. Na-comment ako rin sa yeah. ko na yeah. gano'n nangyari. Even yung isa, nasa pro account na, palos na yung pro account niya eh. Oh. eh eventually, naibalik niya yung 2K. <laughs> <laughs> sa isang araw, mga tiyan ng 2K. Dahil oh. sa oh. simpleng strategy na mang scalping na natutasan ko. And Are ginawa you... rin niya. Yeah, the new strategy yeah. is more on a it's more momentum trading, diba? Uh yeah, momentum and breakout basically. Okay. Um actually ano yun eh uh, more on uh the the two, two legged pullback strategy may, pero yung breakout line tinitira ko. Um, ah okay. Yung same minsan, kasi, same minsan ES they do uh, what they call uh, uh sometimes they do a bull trap or a, or a bear trap. That's true. And ang ang tatagitin mo lang kung na-mix mo lang na hindi ka ma nasa dulo nung trend. Tama. Uh, tama so tama. that's why I, I keep saying na kila tingnan mo yung trend line. Yeah. Ah uh, nasa nasa trend channel ka ba nasa gitna ka ba? Kung nasa gitna ka safe ka. Eh. Yeah. Kung nasa dulo ka na wala na. Yeah, wala na. Kung na-try, yeah. <laughs> di ba? Oh, Ara kasi oh, tama. Kailangan lang lang gawin 'yon. Gawin lang nilang gawin 'yon. At oh. sabi ko, I've only been profitable sa umaga yeah. between 6 a.m. onwards sabi ko ganyan I've tried to do this sa gabi ah, so bali 6 a, 6 a.m. sa bali the opening of the mar uh, open, market opening of the ETH ETH yes. hours di ba? yes okay yes. yeah so um, pre-market maganda movements yeah. nung yung flash tax din oh. yun and then by siguro mga 10 o'clock all done na ako oh. actually hindi sa market open mismo hindi ko na rin siya tinitrade. No, tama. Um, and then after that, na, since nag pasok na ang step to me scaling na. Mm. Um, so I was trying the same strategy. Tapos hindi ko na maipasa, sabi ko. Siguro dahil I was trading more contracts uh, before. Mm. Um, so I was trying to push more trades in a day. Right. 
just to uh, make, uh, meet a certain uh, profit target. Mahirap, mahirap yun. The more the kasi the more time you spend in the market, most likely you'll give it back. Yeah, true. So I was trying, trying, trying. Nananalo ako. Mm. Pero since I was trading like two contracts or um, magsisimula ng two contracts. Yeah. Um, eventually, pag tagal na ng inline trades ko, datatalo ako, nabubura oh. eh. So, yeah, tama. Sabi ko, nako, kailangan palitan ko yung scalp strategy ko. Hindi ito effective sa oh. step two. Oh. Nag-research na naman ako sa steps ako. Pero wala na akong ma-research na iba strategy. Tapos biglang natuklasan ko itong NQ. Mm. Sabi ko, ano ba itong NQ? <laughs> <laughs> hindi pinakarala ko yung so I, I put ES and NQ side right. by side yeah. Yeah. throughout a day yeah. sa isang buong linggo no. and I was like looking how how they move and Tapos, like ako a, sa N- and use like a wild bronco hindi hindi pwede ka mag tame <laughs> yes so, <laughs> so, so yung NQ mga sabi ko oh, ang galing ng movements ng NQ ah, mamamatay yung tao no? oh. <laughs> <Tama. laughs> ang market open sabi Tama. ko eh. tagal lang account mo kung hindi ka marunong <laughs> di ba so sabi ko Okay to us. Then, sabi ko, kung nag-scalp lang ako, kunin ko na lang ng paunti-unti yung profits to. Eh, ang ganda pa ng movements ng NQ at that time. So, nowadays, yung NQ, hindi na masyado ganun kalakas yung, ano, yung volatility. Yeah. Mahina rin yung range ng movements niya. Hindi Tama. na talagang big moves na 100 points, yeah, yeah. 50 points, points di ba? Sa isang right. candle lang yun, ha? Yeah. So, parang, um, at that time, so I, I was trading market open only, okay, 930 to 945, mm. NQ lang. Yeah. And I was making mga 1,000 to 2,000 uh, already. A day, um, wow. Ilang oras ba na trade mo doon? 15 minutes lang a day. <laughs> so, <laughs> dahil natutas ako nga yung NQ. Uh, and I was like trading 4 to 8 contracts. Right, uh, right. Pero I started with 2. Right. And then... Since na-meet ko yung ano, target profit, then I increased it to 4. Right. Pag na-meet ko na scaling plan and then everything. And then eventually, I, I, I passed step 2. Right. Uh, so for two, two of those uh, strategies. So that was a um, $150,000 account. Yung na fund ka na $150,000. Yes, yes, yes. And so, so you, and, you made profit there. How much profit did you make? So funded account. Uh, so basically nung no, no, magpas lang ako ng 5k winidraw ko na rin kagad eh kasi sabi ko I, I wanna try my own sabi right. ko ganyan so ayun sabi ko marami na akong nagastos sa mga reset sabi ko balik ko muna sa sarili ko diba yeah, so tama, sabi tama. ko tapos um, I opened my own trade of it account right. I was like trading it pero mahina rin eh kasi uh, ang, ang, na, at least na experience ko yung personal account mm. Kung hindi malaki ang ano mo, capital mo, no, mahirap din mag-trade na sarili. Uh, because I was trading like one contract. One tama. contract. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then, yeah. kung bumaba ka pa sa margin, oh, sige, yeah. micro na lang. Yeah, and then, micro. eventually, yung scalping ko, hindi na effective sa micro kasi nakinakain lang ng commission. Oh, yeah, commission talaga. Tama. Pero I did try it. At least, I did try it. Yeah, um, sa live account mo. Yeah. So, pero dahil nga, I got used to oy, making 500 to 1,000, 1K a day. Mm. Para ka lose hope din kasi yung misa na nirisky 100 eh. So parang dahil, tapos ang dami ko pang trace na ginawa nun ha, sa uh-huh. micro. Uh-huh. <laughs> like 100 na nagawa ko. Kakasama <laughs> na loob eh. <laughs> so eh, nag, eventually, sabi ko, oy, end to trade. Tapos ang uh-huh. ganda pa ng mga offering, sabi mo. Uh-huh. One step lang, tapos... Yun nga lang, may trailing, uh, light trailing drawdown. Yeah. So, doon ako na, na, na ano, sa end to trade. And then, eventually, um, in-apply ko lang the same. And you, same strategy. And you got, yeah. you got funded for one account sa uh, end to trade. Yes. Uh, and then, eventually, um, na, ano, after ko mapandol, nag-withdraw na rin ako ulit eh. Uh, ano, I tried something else. Ano account sa uh, earn to trade? Anong uh, 150,000 then? Yes, 150 lang. 150 pa rin ang tinarget ko sa intertrade. Okay. Dahil lang, basically, ang tarata, kaya 150k normally is just because of the drawdown. Right. And then daily loss limit. Right. Kasi uh, alam ko yung style ko, kumakain talaga na, <laughs> ng, yeah. draw, ng drawdown. Eh. Right. So, um, but, pero kung was, you get used to it, right. yun ang kinagandaan. 
So, yeah. so how much money did you make to earn the trade before you withdrew it? With you, you do withdrew your profits, five thousand. Yeah, si- yeah, more, more than five thousand. Okay. Um, ang maximum yata is ano eh? Tama five k lang yung ano oh. yung one hundred percent sa yow. Yeah. Um, in one time. Right. Yep. And then after into trade, um, netok plus ako naman tong lilo. Yeah, lilo uh, tama. Sabi sabi ko. Actually, nakita ko ni Lilo eh, pero parang sketchy, sabi ko. Kasi, mm. ano ba itong website na ito? Oh, tama. Um, eh, hindi, walang kwenta tama. eh, sabi ko. Oh, Oo, na, walang kwenta. Tama. <laughs> tama yung <laughs> look, ano, parang scammer ba ito? <laughs> Oo, oh, oh, sabi ko, siguro, ano lang ito, ginagaya lang nila itong, ano, yung end to trade. Top step. Tsaka, yeah, that, oh, top oh, step. Yeah. At least yung end to trade. Ang ganda ng website, kahit paano, oh, yung dashboard. Tama. Yeah, tama. Talagang, ano, ah, uh, Pero itong lilo, wala nga ang dashboard wala, wala. na malaman mo kung ano yung, <laughs> <laughs> kung ano yung for profit mo, eh, di ba? <laughs> eh, sabi ko, makakalokohan nito. Pero it turns out, hindi naman, hindi naman. Uh, valid naman yung lilo, eventually. Um, so I tried lilo, uh, but I start, I didn't go with the 150k. Uh, oh, well, you started with what? Kasi, I, start, I started with the 50k then. Kasi sabi ko may promo lang. Yeah, so, tama. Pasado then, ka? Pasado ka? Ay, hindi. Sabi ko, hindi ako pumasa nun sa 50K. Marami okay. rin ako nun. Sinubukan na how many times before um, I actually pass. Uh, so, 50K. And then, throughout that, between the end to trade to Lilo, mm. uh, I, I got introduced to doing other style of trading. Hindi okay. lang scalping. So, okay. Um, and then I discovered some of the other indicators like able sees, mm. uh, young harmonic patterns. Yeah, yeah. Si, Marami si, rin na si, ma- ano, uh, si, uh, si, ba, si DC? Si DC? Ano yun? Sa group mo? Yung babae? Sa, Harmon, harmo, harmonic trader siya. Or, ah, si DC. Yes, uh, yeah, yes. Yeah. yeah, so basically si DC, nakilala ko rin yan sa Facebook group na Pilipino mm. and then nag like, futures trading siya um na naano rin siya do sa harmonic oh, pattern patterns. trading yeah, eh. tama yeah yeah actually sa sa kay kay, kay Jan kay Jan uh Jan trader ko yan na nagpasa yung harmonic ah, okay, pattern okay. yung sa legatos i'm not sure kung ah the, yeah yun. i know i think i i heard i saw your some of your post i uh, know i yeah. never heard of legatos okay so you try okay, legatos so it, Actually, yung legatos, yeah, uh, they, they approached me to, ah, wow. to to try it out, sabi niya. So, kaya tinry ko rin yung, lugar, yung group nila. Oh. Um, and then, uh, I tried to learn whatever I can at that time. Right. Uh, um, so, naitindihan ko yung mga uh, iba-ibang patterns ng harmonics. And yeah. then, um, but... That's when I found out na hindi ko kaya mag-hold ng isang trade. <laughs> to, to a certain target profit. Kung nakikita ko na may profit ako, oh. bitan na ini-exit ko na So, hindi ko ma-hold eh. Hindi. So, <laughs> Pero, <laughs> so, so um, you went back to ano, scalping? Yes. So, <laughs> I still went back to scalping. But I was trying to target like more than one point. Right, uh, right. Siguro mga five points na. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, Pa- parang ano lang pero I was trying to trade with more contracts instead yeah. of one yeah. pero sila kasi suggest nila talaga one contract lang if you're doing swing trading mm. one contract lang uh, saka ka naman scale eh hindi naman ako magaling mag scale din mm. tama so, sabi ko right. more contracts na lang and then tagal na get the yeah. profit and alis na sabi ko ganun so after that um, then si I was cho- showing na meron ako nakuha indicator sa ano and this I was trying to stream it as well in the right. in the group and then na encourage ni si DC na oh itong XABCD trading or something right. hindi niya na, doon naman niya nakuha yung sa kanyang uh, harmonic pattern yes and nakita niya na maganda yung result niya so ngayon stick na siya sa style na yun yeah she's more of a swing trader di ba mhm yeah and then isang, yung isa Pilip- yun si DC sa group niya it's a uh, mm-hmm. Pilipina din siya pero taga East Coast taga I think Virginia parang ganun yep 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 akala ko nga dati taga California eh oh. kung dumipad lang sila or something oh. pero ganang mga pero... Pilipina ganang sila mag like dito si Christian so now I know a lot of Filipinos in fact you're talking about scalping di ba yung isang yeah. 
friend ko si Greg. He started in forex. He was a big forex trader. Galing siya mag forex talaga pero hanggang isang broker niya na ban sa ginagamit niya, I think it was gain, hindi ko alam gain or forex.com. He got banned in the US. So from that point on, he didn't want to trade forex anymore. I introduced him to uh-huh. futures when he saw futures ago. Ano ba to? Because he didn't want to do it until he saw what results I was getting. He said, "Wow, maybe we should try it." He was uh, working so Walgreens, Kalama Walgreens, diba? Yeah, yeah. He was working there so Walgreens as a as a I think one of a manager or supervisor parang ganun. And um he started trading because in forex he took a $50 account and made it up to $5,000. So forex. So when he saw this, he took advantage of it. So he started trading one country. In fact, I met him I, I, I remember when you said Lilo. You said Lilo. I got introduced to Lilo by. Um, do you know that uh, Apex? Do you know the Apex Investing? Yeah, 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 yeah. I used to work. Me and Greg used to be with them. Because hey, Greg was the one who was basically coming up with the strategies that uh, we know. Daryl. Daryl is the CEO. Okay. Daryl. I met Daryl at Trading Expo in uh, Vegas, and at that time he was. Trading futures and his big thing was at that time Nadex. That's how I became a Nadex free. And he took me out to lunch. We talked and he said, "Wow." He said at that time not a lot of people were trading Nadex. He was the only one making a lot of money on Nadex. And so when uh, he found out that I was trading Nadex, he said, "Well, here, let's meet in Vegas. Um, we'll you there. I'll, I'll take you out to lunch." So we had lunch. We had a good conversation. And at that time, I, I found out uh, with. Uh, Marcello and then all of a sudden Greg me and Greg were with this other group called Binary Trade Group he was doing the systems there as well Kayon he was he got recruited by um, um, by Daryl to go into Apex to do his strategy to apply it to uh, Apex because at that time Apex was bo- involved with Nadex and also futures trading I was the okay. one doing I was doing uh, I, they were going to give me a trade room for their subscribers I was doing well in 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 uh, Nadex but then I was looking I, what the way I was training Nadex was I was using a futures account or a chart futures chart uh-huh, that's how okay. I get to the expiration because hey, it's a Nadex you have a 1 minute expiration you have a 20 minute ako I was really good at the 20 minute expiration and the 1 hour expiration si Greg naman he, he cre- came up with a system that traded the 1 minute expiration galing and wow. so he was doing that And Hangang, uh, he decided to leave Apex because Greg was the one who, who basically got me into Apex. Because uh, he said, "Oh, I have a friend," and and uh, there was, "Oh, I know, I, I remember Dominic. Yeah, bring him in." So we started doing Apex. I was doing more of the beta testing of their systems. Oh. So after that, um, I left Apex. I started doing my own thing. Um, so what happened was with Greg. You know, he's he's a scalper like you. Because say before, I didn't like scalping. Because say parang but I found out most of these institutional traders they scalp. Because say sobrang daming contacts sila, they scalp between three to four uh, ticks. Yun lang. Because mm-hmm. they're trading more than they're trading a thousand contracts, in some five thousand contracts. So why would they try to swing trade? They they'd rather um, scalp. So yeah. uh, so what what Greg did? He he came up with a system, a scalping system. And uh, he basically scalps between his system was basically six stick scalp. And you know what? He was trading between 20 to 30 contracts. He was making he would do two or three trades lang. Katulad mo, di ba? Two or three mm, trades lang. Yeah. He was done making between anywhere from three to five thousand dollars a day. Mm, yeah. So with that, he he quit his job, and uh, this that's what he do, does right now. He just does that. Don't you get bored? He goes no. How can I get bored? If I, you know, I, I can do anything I want. <laughs> yeah. yeah, and eh, eh, na target ko dito sa Lilo. Yeah. Uh, that's why, uh, yun lang yung nag nagbigay sa akin ng opportunity na magkaroon ng multiple accounts. Yeah. Eh, to, to be able to leverage more contracts. Tama. A, yeah, each it's, of each account. Right. You know? Right. Because <laughs> you don't get one need zero. He had as how many accounts? Sha. He has. He has. I think uh, three three hundred thousand dollar accounts. And another hundred thousand, another fifty thousand. But all in all, he would do that because hey, that's where I got that trade copy, right? Yeah. Yeah. Eh. So, yeah. It so. works. <laughs> it works. And the thing is, he showed me a check where he cashed out from Lilu 
over six hundred thousand dollars in 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 uh, in not commission, pero profit. Wow. And, and so that's why I found out ah that when he was able to cash out from Lilo. That's why I said oh legit naman legit naman ng Lilo. Mm-hmm. And plus the advantage of Lilo is you can trade more than one account, which is good because not these other accounts you can you know these other uh, prop firms you can only trade one uh, one account at a time, di ba? Yeah, and um, ang, at least doon sa difference ng Lilo with multiple accounts, during evaluation, oo, oh, you, you try to target at least 600 to 1K right. a day right. uh, just to be able to pass it. Right. But once you're funded, you only target 100 to 200. Yeah. Tama. And then just keep repeating the yeah. same Tama. thing until you get funded again. Yeah, yeah. You know? yeah, yeah. So, ayun eh. Sana may, may, mag-gets din ng ibang mga tao. Ilang, 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 how many accounts do you have right now? The funded accounts. Right now, right? yeah. Right, right now, I, I, I currently have at least three. Wow, galing. Uh, is lahat sa Lilo or iba iba? Ah, uh, right now, the Lilo and N N to three. Galing. Yep. So now you heard it. This guy, I'm, just, I'm, I'm trying to get my students to get past at least one. Pero ikaw tatlo na, galing. Yeah, uh, yeah. So, ma, hindi naman la- lagi pag uh, isang sign up ko isang evaluation na papasko no. na no, may, may bumabaksak din. Yeah, yeah, pero, yeah, pero once you pass it, iba yung pag-alaga mo na eh. Once yeah, you, you pass it, yeah. because you, you don't try to achieve something else. Tama, you, tama. Ta- Just do consistent. Lang. Like yung sinabi mo, basta $200, pwede na yun. Build mo yeah. na lang yung account, di ba? Bisa nga, isang trade lang yun, makuha mo nga. Oh, tama, tama, <laughs> tama, tama, tama. So, ano tawag dito? So, I... Try you, uh, you profit trader. Try mo yon. Yeah, yun na yung plan ako. Uh, na banggit mo rin sa akin na no. ilalam mo si Lindsay. Yeah, Lindsay. Uh, so, so far, hindi ko pa siya nakakausap eh. Eh, yung day trading academy ng Facebook group, mm. parang siya owner or something. Yeah, kasi, I, I, in fact, I reached out to her kasi she, she found out that I was with uh, Marcello. She was one of the master oh, traders. Okay. So, I think what happened was well, I'm not gonna. I don't want to. Best ah, um, legit siya kasi she's the system that she's using is also almost the same way. Um, that same system that Marcello that there's a lot of former uh, master traders are using Marcello's system. It's really it's a good base. It's a good foundation. Ako mm-hmm. yung I I'm using that as a base, but I'm also. I have another system that I, I trade on it. I use the VWAPs, which actually work really well with it. And uh, this one, I uh, see that's why I never got, became a scalper until uh, I'm looking at, your, at what you're doing. I trade and I can easily get five points. Easily. Easily uh-huh. between three to five points. And, you know, like I said, if you want to, I'll show you the system, but there's two indicators I usually use. Diba sa MACD, anong, anong, anong moving average nila? EMA yun sa 12 and 26, diba? Yeah. Alapain mo dun sa chart mo sa 12 and 26 EMA. When you have this cross between, I do it across between a, a a 50 or even I would say that 52 EMA, a 12 EMA, and a 20, 26 MA. When you see the cross, when you see both the 12 and the 26 below or above, depende. If it it's below the 52 MA, you sell. So this is a ES. You, you can easily get three to five points easily, not even thinking. And your you stop you slap stop loss more is around uh, 10, 10, 6, yeah. Let's say two to three points. Yun lang. Pero wow. yung target mo between three to five points kaya yon. Oh, really? One time I had a trade there. I had it on my live stream. I had a trade where it was uh, fifteen points. Nice. <laughs> fifteen points is some contract yon. Ay, sir. Ay, yeah, sir. let me know if you want. I'll just show you what I do. And so, you, if you want to do that, because you just have to do two trades. Yeah, true, true. You're true, done yeah. with that. Yeah. yeah, and that's why ha. you can combine your 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 um your bot. You can do your bot and hit your goal at the same time. You can trade this manually and hit your goal yeah. too. Because hey, there are once you hit once you see the pattern yes because this, that pattern repeats every single day several times a several times during the day kung uh, hit mo yon mao tigil mo na <laughs> 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 but that's like I said 
your system, because I've, I've never been a scalper until I saw this. And well, I'm getting them at At least my bot consistent and bot. And that's why I wanted to introduce that to my students. I said, oh, sign up. Nice. They told at least I know mga mga Pinoy din. Kasi alam nila. Alam mo, mga Pinoy, they want something that's going to help them. And I, I don't blame them. Kasi dito, babang sualdo dito. You came from here. Iba mababang sualdo dito sa mga foreign companies din. Mababang sualdo. Yeah. Yeah, babe, eventually kasi, um, kaya ako rin naman din na pinupukusan tong futures trading uh, and learning my own strategies um, para matulong ako yung mga the, I want to teach my brother, my sister. Yeah. Uh, sister ko, accountant yun. <laughs> so, ah, dito sa Pilipinas or dyan sa... Sa Pilipinas, sa okay. Pilipinas. Um, and then yung brother ko na nakatira sa Australia. Oh. Na eventually, pwede nilang gawin sa sarili nila. Yeah. Um, siguro wala silang time or yeah. medyo siyempre kailangan mo nang may, may sarili kang investment to to pay for your evaluation right. until makuha ko na 100% yung na oy consistent na profitable no, that's the time that I, I try to push them yeah. because sa tingin ko talaga it can replace their current salary yeah, kung ano man salary nila yeah. di ba? Yeah. maski even $50 so, a day ano pwede mag ano you can build that up and keep on doing it consistently yeah, and, Ang kinaganda sa Pilipinas, panggabi. Sa gabi nila gagawin eh. Yeah. Di ba? Yeah. Uh, so it doesn't affect their current yeah, job. Tama. Do this panggabi, isang oras, yun ang tapos ka na. Isang oras well, kalahati at the most. Kasi like I said, I put the robot on between 9, uh, 9, 9 a.m. Or dito, 9 p.m. to uh, 11.30 p.m. Tapos na ako. And I'm not yeah. even doing it. I just have to manage it and see how it's doing. Yeah. Di ba? Pero galing. And I can't yep. see. I can't wait to see. You know, yung sana yung ano yung isang ro- yung bot mo yung uh, the test mo ngayon. Let's see how that goes. Pero yeah, ngayon, actually, dalaw- dalawa yung ex- dalawang bot yung kinokod ko uh, at this time. Um, minimize sure ko lang na tama yung entries and exit and right. setups. Um, because I manually analyze it first before I actually code it. Kung paano ko implement. Uh, and since by nature. Kung computer science ako, oh. sabi ko, ay, and that's why I wanted to do trading at first eh. Kasi sabi ko, if they can do it, dapat magawa ko rin kasi maroon ako mag-analyze, di ba? <laughs> tawa, so, tawa, ko, tawa, 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 tawa. <laughs> and then, boss, ma-analyze ko, dapat ma-code ko rin to, sabi ko ganyan. Kasi sabi ko, andyan lahat ng ano, factors, tama. lahat ng yeah, yeah. items, man. Yeah, so, I'm trying no, but... to push it. My last question, alam ko ano, lampas na itong sinabi ko, pero galing-galing yung isuwan na usapan natin. Pero, um, so, when, when do you plan to ano, launch, officially launch your ano, yung bot mo? Kasi alam ko, we were, you were talking, um, you had a plan of when to launch. Depende sa mga, kasi you have a lot of people beta testing this uh, bot, yung first bot. That's correct, yeah. Yeah, so basically, this, this June, uh, bago matapos ang May, I will announce it in the Discord group. Okay, good. Um, and and because, I will announce it to the students here kasi sigurado mga students dito, they, I think they'll like what they'll hear. Kasi itong yeah. talaga. And I'm gonna trade it sa, um, in fact, today, this week, I'm gonna trade it on a uh, on an evaluation account. And oh, um, okay. I will, I'll show you the results. But I, I think, uh, I know, since I know what the ES is doing, I think this can be, I mean, like they said, you take the emotions, this bot's going to take the emotions out of trading. And if you can yeah. just do at least $100 to $200 a day, but then you just yeah. do it consistently. And then I like, what I tell the other guys there in the Discord group is, uh, it's like it's like trading, yeah? Mm. Like you're doing the manual trading as well. You do your own analysis. You do your, if you know how the market moves. Right. Eh di, ganun din yung style na gagamitin sa pag, paggamit ng bot. Opo. You yep. know that yep. profitable sa samaga, certain times, stick with it. Stick yep. with it. Uh, wag, kang, wag kang maging greedy. Uh, oh, some, some of them try to be greedy, yeah. run it the whole night, <laughs> right, run it right, the whole right, day. Right, right, right. And then they will say, oh, I got a big loss. Oh, I yeah, got yeah, a yeah. big loss. It's, and it's, <laughs> a, it's, it's a, almost like manual trading. You can't be trading the whole day. Yeah, true. <laughs> Because the, some setups will not win. <laughs> right, right. Because ibang setups sa afternoon, ibang uh, takbo ng market sa afternoon iba. Yeah, true. Kaya nga das, sabi ko. But if you're good at putting all the settings, you tested it. Yeah. You know, 
Kaya nga, lagi ang binibigay ko lang na, na setting is more on yun sa tingin ko na alam ko to alam ko to mga ibang traders na to they will run this the whole day <laughs> kasi parang misa tinatamad sila gusto nila <laughs> iwan nila ay ko sabi ko wag niyo iwan sabi ko lahat. kaya nga binigay ko na flatten button if oh. you feel that tra- trade is not going your way flatten it yeah. don't wait for it to hit their stop loss di ba kaya kaya yun lang eh. so I, I, sana and then i wanted them to experience it themselves I, I don't wanna call it. I don't wanna call na this should be the trading style you need to do or use a different setting all the time. Right. Um, they need to learn it the way they learn the manual style yeah. Yeah. and then enhance it on their own. Yeah. That's why it's most, it should be flexible enough right. for them. You said they think a bot is uh yeah, it can be automatic, but the thing is you also have to manage it. Yeah. It, it can trade. It can enter trades without emotions. That's the best part. Kasi mahirap yung mga manual if you're manually trading. Ang signal and doon pero mahirap yung mag-press the button to enter kasi yung emotion very emotional you don't want to lose that. Yeah, and but, you might you might enter in a different entry. Right, right. You might exit in a different en- exit. Right, right. At least pag sa bot, yung entry mo sure ka na yeah. doon ang i-entry niya. Yeah, tama. At mas mabilis pa siya sa iyo. Tama. Yo, di ba? Yeah. So yung mga manual, yun, yun lang yung ano kaya nga it, it supplements Yeah, that trade Yeah. Well, anyways, Christian, it's been a pleasure uh, talking to you. Uh, same here. <laughs> uh, but as I said, I'll be I'll be reaching out to you again and again. again. Christian, his uh, his bot will be be coming out soon, like he said in June, and I'll tell you what's going to go on with that. And I think after speaking with him initially about what he plans to do with this, I think it's very advantageous for anyone who's going to use it. Okay, that's all I can say. <laughs> But anyways, again, thank you, Christian. And I, good night. Gabi dyan, di ba? Yep, uh, 11. Yeah, 11. Yep. So, thank you for the time, Christian. Uh, no problem, anytime. Okay. anytime. Ingat. I'll talk to you uh, again. Thank you. Okay. All right, thank you. Okay. Bye-bye. Good night.